friends how are you welcome back to another video of mine so this video is going to be my first ever holiday boxes review slash demo my tart so this is the blush authority apparently these two are the holiday sets for um i don't know whether this is in the permanent in line or uh, but i'm guessing or i'm hoping like this they come out i think one each year so they had as far as my knowledge goes so they had one blush authority nine pan set in last year christmas as well and but this year they have got this maracuja lip trio you can see i i'm like so much i just it just came in the packaging in the mailbox in the morning so then now it's like this so this is the tart nine piece blush authority their holiday pan set and uh this is the maracuja the lip trio set the base makeup is almost done uh just finished with the base just and i'll just try and use this one as well as this one on my face and do you this one this is their holiday kit the blush authority what they name like and it says first of all the sets as you can see from the packaging hope the camera is catching up well this one is the gold packaging this one it's look like the champagne this one is the champagne packaging the packaging yeah this one the earlier one the last year one otherwise i would have done a comparison in the swatches and whatever but let's ne never further let's just get into this one so this opens up like this as you can see and you just need to keep on taking it out in this manner and can you see can you just appreciate just take a moment to appreciate the colors this is so wonderful and so much nice for the i think it's going to trust me it's going to suit all the skin tones it looks beautiful in the pan and i'll just tell you the top shade the top shade is let it glow I'll just give you a quick swatch of this one it's like the perfect you know like the gold it's not like the gold as in gold but you know like a pop of gold it's i'm just sitting near the window and filming this video so and the second one i'll just show you the second one i just let me wipe off my finger <laughs> before dipping it into the second shade so this is the second shade like the tart pinky blushes you have like the nude pinky for the everyday wear this is somewhat like this one i am smitten this one i can see a nude pinky shade it's somewhat you know nude pink with a hint of brown in it like the nudie pink not pink as in pink like the perfect nudie everyday sort of blush if i'm going to wear this i can wear it literally every day it's the third one you can see this is like getting toasty this according to me it's going to be a perfect bronzer topper or you can use it for very fair skin tone it's going to be a perfect bronzer and but i can see specks of it's not matte but you can see specks of shimmer or in this one it's tad bit but it's not perfectly matte i can still find some sort of but and this just literally rolls on like this and i think this is going to be perfect to carrying it in the handbag throw it in the handbag that's it you're perfect good to go you can use it uh, like for your eyeshadows you can use it for your um blushes for highlighters that's what it's supposed to be and this one as you can see from the color tone if i'm going to just compare with the previous one is the one which i just swatched and this one is the second one i'll just also show you the third one so this we have already swatched and these two this one is the gold one which we have already swatched this one is the rose gold one and this one is the champagne one so you can just see the color scheme in between these so i think they are quite different the colors are not repetitive there is new and fresh colors in all that but obviously we all have something like this in our in our makeup wardrobe but for a handbag collection i think these are gorgeous for a handbag collection or maybe just throwing it on a everyday day to day basis i think they are gorgeous in one the top bottom one is yours truly the second one is into you and the third one is playtime so this one 
the first one this one is yours truly if you can see the shade it has got i can see specks of goldenness and uh, i mean this is like pink corally sort of duochrome sort of shade and you it's going to be like perfect for all the skin tones it's you can see it's how gorgeous is this one i hope the camera is catching up well this one is the first one can you see the specks of shimmer particle in this one this is lot like quite finely milled it has got coral with pink and like you know the specks of like this i find totally matte and again this is like very light i don't think this blush is going to show up nice with, nicely in my skin tone but yet i need to try you can see this one this one is the second one the second one and this is like completely nude this is this one and this is one the third one is like pink with a, a hint of purple you can see or lilac this one is the third one and this name is playtime so this is playtime the perfect rosewood type of shade this is this one like you know if you have got an idea of a blush like many people is going to prefer this one because i think this is going to be very versatile quite suitable totally just a autumn friendly sort of blush so matlab 12 mahine pehen sakte ho in mein se i think all of you you can wear 12 months in a year if you can just see i don't know whether the camera is going to catch up or not but this is like the perfect highlighter perfect perfect this is your highlighter perfect you know look like one of those where you have got the uh, gold silver champagne like like the proper duochrome one this is like the proper duochrome one oh can you just see oh just have a look guys it's looking beautiful i just rubbed off my hand swatches from the previous blushes and uh, because this was wet can you see the pigmentation on a wet hand it's coming out so well this is the first shade this one it's like the perfect highlighter and this one is called called the frosted frappe and the second one like the perfect like this i find quite similar to melba max melba although i do not have that blush shade so this is like the perfect nudey sort of again a very good everyday wear shade and its name is sweet cheeks nice very flattering very gorgeous so this is this one if you can see it's look beautiful so let's so that's it for the swatches guys and let's move ahead before we move into the maracuja lip trios let's just i'll just show you once and uh, then we'll start with the review and demo so apparently this comes in and yes to talk about the packaging let me start with this packaging this is like a, it comes in the maracuja lip trio this is their juicy lip balm sort of thing and uh, if i'm just going to open it and just show you how it looks like it comes beautifully packed beautifully boxed even both of them are beautifully boxed if you want to give it in a Uh, to someone for the holiday season someone who is a makeup lover and someone who likes collecting makeup it's a very good option and quite good value for money considering you have got three in them and very good value for money and i'll just show you the packaging this is like the traditional what do you say traditional in the tube it's not in a tube but still a nice click pen sort of packaging can you see you're just going to click from the bottom the product is going to come so this one, let me start with the demo of uh, the first one i'll just try to use it as much as i can but uh, i'll just take this medium shade from here and then i'm just going to just i'll just pat it and can you see it has got a tiny small mirror it looks so beautiful and so cute that i do not need this one extra mirror so on the go i think they are perfect so i'm just trying to build up my crease uh a mix of these two colors from the first palette and this is the gold palette with the one with the gold one the fan as well so i think this one is i'm going to just use for the blush i'm just so today i'm just going to try two different blushes on both the cheeks 
just to show you as much as I can in this colors. I'm just taking this color here from this pan. And this is your champagne pan. This one is the champagne color one. So I'm just taking the bottom shade and just trying to just trying to give some placing it lightly in the outer V. So too fancy. My top one, I'm just going to use this one and just placing it. I'll just try to play with as many colors as I can in this video. I'm just trying to be very experimental today. So like that and taking a matte shade again from this palette I'm just trying to and this is quite a fluffy brush just trying to build it as much as i can put some for this for some extra definition yeah, this one this is going to be a perfect blush shade the dark the brownish shade from here and i could feel from the bottom it's like quite powdery for my inner corners so today i'm just going to use this gold one so for my inner corners i'm just using this gold one let's see So I'm just going to place it in the inner eyelids. That's it. That's it, guys. And now again, taking the fluffy brush, I'm just taking this matte shade from here. And just, so I'm just taking this shade, just blending it through. So that's it. I just need to coat up piece of mascara and falsies and i'm all done for this so you can see it's looking beautiful but of course i need something more and let's let's quickly move on to the blushes you can see it's it's looking so nice the eye makeup is looking gorgeous and for the blush i'm just going to use this because i find this very good can you see how pigmented is this and i've just taken barely and just doing like this one more blush on top of it so i've just used a combination of these two blushes can you see how beautifully it's pigmented oh nose contouring although this is not that one let's see how it performs trying to be experimental in this video so i'm just using this one it has it's brown with not bad not bad at all and for my brows can you see it that like the it's so much so much powdery and the same for the same i'm just using this one can you see how pigmented is this sorry my fan brush is upstairs my highlighter brush so i'm just using the same brush for the highlighting that's it guys see it's beautifully done beautiful maracuja lip trio sorry the wrong way and i'll show you the three colors first this is holiday spritz and i'll just tell you and i think this one is the nudest of all i was just wearing this shade in the morning i'll, I'll just give you the swatch of this one this is holiday spritz like the perfect pinky nude sort of shade let's see how does it looks in my lips because it's i'm just going to try and layer it for the maximum color pigmentation for the video so for the first thing i can find that this is quite nice and quite uh, practical sort of shape to carry it in your makeup bag and like it's not going to smudge or you cannot literally damage the tube or you cannot even the product you can see it's safely in there you're not going to nick it off 
so i think this is quite nice and if you're going to look at the shade it looks very nice quite comfortable on the lips and you know it's not sticky like one of those glosses formula and first of all it has got like its maracujo oil like the tart claims it has got all the benefits of skincare in a cosmetic in a lip gloss or in a lipstick what you can say and it looks beautiful so this one is the first shade called holiday spritz this mary martini like the watermelon sort of pink let's see how it's going to look i'm just clicking it from here from the bottom watch is how juicy it looks like this is like the perfect juicy sort of watermelon shade it looks like you know i'm eating something when you eat something and you have got those licky licky lips every day again i i find these all three it looks like too much pink from the swatch but trust me on the lips it's like the perfect hint of pink like the perfect stainy pink it's looking wonderful buttered rum oh this for me is like the perfect brown sort of shade that one was nude this is like the perfect brown on my skin tone and i can feel when it's going on the lips it's quite comfortable You see, this is beautiful. This is all three shades are beautiful. So this is the third one called Butter Drum. So these are three shades and the nine please blush collection from the Tarte Holiday Twenty Twenty uh, range. Hopefully you like my video, and if you like it, guys, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really means a lot for me, and I'm really looking forward. to so that you can subscribe i really want to have all of your support and if you have got any suggestion or anything would you want to see more in the videos then please feel free to drop a message to comment down and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much and i'll see you in my next video bye guys